Today I'm going to end up patina in the body, or working on a little bit of adding some patina. So you can see up here it's nice, but back here it needs, needs some work to make it look as old as the rest. Same with this side of the box here. This side looks nice. Probably not even going to mess with this side. I'm going for that patina look, you know. I want it to look cool, like it's just fresh off the farm kind of deal. Yeah. I think it'll work. I just, I want a shit that'll like block out heat mostly. Yeah. Because I had to drip out the original shit. You just kind of got to repeat the process so you get it where you want it. Have to go quite a bit more.
Looking pretty cool though. Alright, so I got this going pretty good here. Got the roof. Got pretty much everything now. Looks pretty badass. Uh, I like how right, here, how right here there's this white coming through. But on the door here there isn't a white. Um, I'm guessing they just repainted it as a two-tone truck originally. Uh, so it's got the white up here. So I'm going to actually take some ivory silk paint, which is pretty similar. And I'm going to go over this, clean it all up, go over it. And then I'll kind of sand that and patina that into it and make it, it kind of look like this. So it matches up good on this side. It's coming along good. Did a little more on this side, nothing major, but I'm doing some stuff right here with black and brown. See, I took, I undercoated it with brown primer, and then I put uh, satin black over the top, and then I used a plastic bag to give it a texture, and then I'll go over and sand it, and, and, and uh, I'm hoping it'll look like rust. So that's pretty cool. Got a lot more work. I'll probably have about 15 hours into it by the time I'm done. Not too bad, I guess. Maybe more, I don't know. We'll see. See how nice it turns out after tonight.